Okay, this part is going to be on cleaning the part and getting it ready for primer paint. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going <clears> to <throat> wash it off with a mild soap and water. And this will be just to kind of primarily get rid of some of the grease and hand and stuff that's on it. <clears throat> I'm using Dawn this soap. I kind of like the idea of how it's a degreaser. Some people say don't use Dawn because it has too many residuals, but <clears throat> I don't know. It's the first time I've done it. I'm going to use it. Once I get done cleaning the whole part, I'm going to go through with a, a plastic parts cleaner as well. So this is just the first first wipe down of it. This thing was polished before they shipped it. You can actually some, see some of the residual polishing color on here on this inside. <clears throat> to be this gray stuff in here. That's the polishing color. Is to stay. Ah, uh, maybe. Okay, what I'm going to chase after with is Proform Plastic Parts Cleaner. It says wash the surface with soap and water, which we did. <clears throat> and then it says saturated clean cots. <clears throat> which is my sacrificial t-shirt will be one of those oh nice sweet Using a clean cloth, apply <clears throat> some. Giving her a good wipe down. Okay. 
All right, there we go. One clean part. Ready for sound. Use the magic pen. Now, as I'm going to start doing the 400 grit wet sand on this thing so I can apply the primer coat to it. Um, so what I'll be doing is I'll be doing the primer sanding, uh, cleaning, applying some primer, and then uh, we'll uh, sand that, get that good to go. And then I'll do a final prime, color, and clear. But that'll be the next video. So here, let's start on the the primary for the primer primer sanding. So what I'm gonna use is I don't have a sanding block, and this is all contour, so it doesn't need to be flat. So I'm gonna use a Mr. Clean eraser block. See how that works out for me. So. I'm using the uh, distilled water here. I'm just gonna do some cross hatch sanding. Get this wet. What I'm looking to do is take off all the shine of this gel coat. And not really apply any physical downward pressure on this. I'm just going to let the sandpaper do its job. Oops, I think it is. Four. <clears throat> so I think you get the picture. I don't think you need to watch me do this for the the whole thing. So what I'll do is I'll bring it back once I have it all complete. And I'll show you what my, my rough up surface looks like.
Alrighty, here it is, finished sanded. It's all 400, wet sanded. There wasn't any real blemishes. Here we go. Next up, primer. Yeah.